I'm over here in Ganado with uh, Mr. Winger. So, uh, go ahead and open up the uh, special meeting, special board meeting at this time. And for the record, uh, we, the time wise, over here in Ganado is 9.32, and that's the mountain daylight saving time. And I guess that's 8.32 over at St. John's. Okay, gentlemen, let's go with item one. Who was? Hey, Brandon, are you there? Yes, sir, Mr. Chairman. Okay, if you could speak up in the mic, please, and um, go ahead and take item one. Okay, is that better? Better. Good morning, Mr. Chairman, members of the board. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, Apache County Emergency Management requests discussion and possible approval to enter into Stage 1 fire restriction upon board approval for today, April 22nd, 2014. We have a weekly uh, work group meeting with the uh, White Mountain Fire Restriction Coordinating Group. That is Apache County, Navajo County, State Forestry, and United States Forest Service. Uh, with those, uh, we received the uh, current conditions along with the projected and predicted weather conditions. Uh, in our last meeting, uh, the report was drier conditions <clears throat> than last week, especially with the wind. ERCs is the energy release component in Alpine are at historic maximums. Lakeside and Heber are at the 90th percentile and also approaching historic maximums. Live fuel moisture uh, and the deciduous trees are getting leaves. The conifers have new growth. Thousand hour fuels, which are your big heavy timber, are at 6 to 10 percent moisture. That's <coughs> basically uh, lower than kiln dried lumber so uh, the lower moisture content that's the fire spread and intensity there's been no real green up this spring as everybody has probably noticed due to the fact that we didn't have any snow we are about three to four weeks ahead of where we were at it last year as far as uh, energy release components, fire danger, and those things. Uh, state forestry went into fire stage one fire restriction on state lands on Friday the 19th. Uh, the Apache Sitgreaves National Forest went into fire restrictions this morning. Navajo County Board of Supervisors is also considering going into stage one fire restrictions at their meeting at nine o'clock this morning. And as your emergency management director, I would recommend that we, as uh, Apache County, enter into stage one fire restrictions. Thank you. Thank you, Chief. What are the wishes of the board? Hey, Mr. Chairman, this is Supervisor Weller. Uh, I move that we uh, approve the request to go into stage one fire restrictions with uh, just a couple questions. Okay, there's a motion, there's a second. Go ahead and second that, sir. Okay, there's a second. Okay, your questions, Mr. Weller? Yeah, comment to the very well presented uh, Chief Deputy Eager. I appreciate all the details to that. I was just curious uh, with the sprinkles we received uh, a little bit further north, did uh, the forest get a little bit more moisture last week and to help with this? Is this ERC as of today or was it before that last little moisture? Uh, Mr. Chairman, Supervisor Weller, that was as of uh, last week. The small amount of precip that we did receive over the weekend uh, was not measurable on most parts of in most parts of our county. Uh, where it was measurable was less than two hundredths of an inch, and the uh, just for a, a point of reference, there is a red flag warning out for today. Uh, beginning at 11 o'clock until 7 o'clock this evening, which is uh, put out by the National Weather Service. Thank you. Okay, uh, gentlemen, I, for one, you know, I know that this is something that we really, that's really needed. Uh, we 
need to um, uh, the fire restrictions. I know it's going to be coming up um, probably on the Navajo Nation as well. And I know in in our area up north, District One, and I'm sure District Well, District Two definitely. You know, it's you know our trees are drying out, and it's something that we need to do, gentlemen. So, um, if, if um, Mr. If Chairman. Ms. Chairman, this is Supervisor Weller. I have another. Weller. Uh, yeah, uh, this is a question for our county attorney, I believe. Uh, Mr. Eager has asked us to go into stage uh, one fire restrictions, but there's a resolution presented before us. Should we actually make the motion to approve the resolution so that it is official in that manner to go into stage one? Uh, Joe, Joe Young? Yes. Yeah. Yes, yeah, I'm here. Okay, uh, Supervisors. I. I Step the resolution quickly, um, just to make it easier for the board to implement the restriction. It's not necessarily, we don't necessarily need to approve the restriction or not, but if the board decides to approve the resolution, it should be part of the motion. Um, and, and like I said, the order establishing five restrictions has to be passed a few different places within the county, so the resolution makes it a little bit easier to pass that order along rather than just by word of mouth or pointing to the minutes of the meeting. So, but you're right that the resolution does have to be approved uh, specifically in the motion. So, Mr. Okay. Chairman, I would Mr. offer... Do you want to include that in your motion? Yes, I would, uh, I would amend the motion to state that uh, the board is uh, approving the resolution 2014-whatever the next one is in sequence from our res resolution numbers. Uh, stating that the county will be going into stage one fire restrictions. Okay. Sounds okay, uh, Mr. Shirley? Yeah, all right. I'll, I'll go along with that. Okay. If there's no uh, further questions or comments, then we'll go ahead and call for the question here. All in favor, say aye. 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 Okay. Opposed? Motion carries. Three in favor, turn the post. Thank you. Let's move on to uh, item two, uh, Mr. Winkert. Yes, uh, Mr. Chairman, item number two is notification that Senator Flake will be touring the White Mountains today. He'll fly into Springerville uh, to visit with local elected officials from approximately 10 a.m. to 10.20 at the airport. There's a, there's a room up, up there I guess they're going to meet in. So this is just notification in case uh, two of the board members wanted to be there at the same time. Um, I know uh, Supervisor Weller talked about being there. So anyway, just a notification. Okay, that's uh, Supervisor Weller. Are you going to be up there by any chance? Yes, I intend to be over there at 10 o'clock. Okay. Um, as for myself, um, as soon as this meeting is over, you know, we're going to be visiting um, District 1. We'll be in your area, Mr. Shirley. Okay, sir. Yeah. Okay, well... I believe that takes care of the uh, special board meeting. Is there a motion to adjourn? So moved. I'll second it. Okay, all in favor say aye. 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 The special board meeting is hereby adjourned. Thank you, gentlemen.